Hey, how's it going? My name is Matt, and today I'm going to be talking all about closed captions on Zoom. We're going to talk about your settings available to you as a participant, and then we'll also talk about how, as a host, you can enable this setting um, so that all of your meetings have closed captions. So first of all, closed captioning looks like this. It's basically just a live transcript of everything that's being said by everybody um, in your Zoom meetings. So if you're a participant and you want to turn this off, uh, you can toggle uh, the captions on or off by going to the closed caption button button on your toolbar. So if you tap that, just like mute, it'll turn off captions. You can turn them on um, at any point by clicking it back on. If you don't see this button available to you in your Zoom meeting, that means that the host of the meeting uh, does not have closed captions turned on. So you will have to request that they turn that on and it's in settings and I'm going to show you how to do that in just a second. Uh, the other thing um, that you want to be aware of as a participant in a Zoom meeting with closed captions are settings. So if you go to this small up arrow here, you can click on subtitle settings and this opens up a window with a bunch of different settings that you can adjust including font size. So if we drag this here, it will uh, make the text much larger or smaller. Uh, you can also change the color of the text. Um, and you can check this box if you want by default for captions to be shown automatically. Uh, if you uncheck it, that means if captions are enabled, you'll have to toggle it on for it to show up. Those are really the only ones that I think that are relevant for you as a participant. And again, if you don't see this and you're a participant in a Zoom meeting, you're going to have to request that the host enables it. So now, switching gears, we'll talk about as a host how you can enable closed captioning uh, for all of your Zoom meetings. So if you want this to happen uh, for your meetings going forward, this is how you do it. Um, I'm going to close this here. You're going to need to log in to Zoom on your browser. So we'll open up a browser window. I use Brave. And in your browser, um, you're going to go to zoom.us slash profile. And if you're not logged in, you'll have to sign in with your Zoom email and password. Then you want to go down here on the left to settings. And from settings, the easiest way to get to closed caption settings is just by searching for closed caption. And this will automatically pull up all the different settings you need. Um, I turn all of them on. Manual captions uh, is, is not what you're seeing in the meeting, but I have it turned on because it allows third party um, services to add closed captions. You can save captions, which um, allows the users to save the transcripts, which is nice, but this is the most important one, automated captions. If you want captions to show up like you just saw, you wanna make sure this button is clicked on. Um, I also enable full transcript, that's up to you. That means that during the meeting, your participants will be able to see a full transcript uh, near the chat if they wanna scroll back. Um, I have that enabled also. And then these are just recordings. Uh, if you wanna enable the captions to be saved with the recording. Um, there's a lot of benefits to that, such as being able to search just for text. Um, so that's kind of useful. So I have all of these enabled. Um, you can obviously choose the ones that, that you want, but this is, this is how you do it. So there you have it. Um, that's how you enable uh, your, your closed captions as a host in your Zoom meetings. And we also talked about how to adjust your meeting settings as a participant to make sure that closed captions are working best for you. That's all today. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a hope you have a nice day.